Hi everyone, this is Annie Olafua from Storied and at Storied we're all about kickstarting business breakthroughs using the awesome power of storytelling. And in this video, we're going to be looking at exactly how stories can turn a no into a yes in your client conversations. But first, just a little bit about what we do at Stories. Yes, we're all about using stories to grow your business, to drive sales and marketing, and to have really meaningful client interactions. But what we're not about is expensive courses, um, long manuals that you have to read. We just want to make it easy, accessible, affordable and fun to start using stories to grow your business. So let's look at what we're going to talk about today, which is how your stories can turn a no into a yes when you're doing that pitch for your clients. So have a look at this. Does this ring any bells? I certainly hope so, because this scene is from that magical movie, Mary Poppins. I love that film. It's one of my childhood favorites. And I know a lot of you have a warm place in your heart for that movie as well. It was full of great songs, but this particular scene is from the song she was singing called A Spoonful of Sugar. Do you remember how it goes? A spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. Yeah. Luckily, I'm not going to try and build a career on singing. The reason I'm talking about this is because this is when somebody has to take medicine that they don't like, but the sugar helps them swallow it and make it more tasty for them. How does that relate to you? Well, your business is like the medicine. Bear with me. Think about it just for a moment. Medicine makes people feel better. It solves problems. And if you're a conscientious business owner, and I'm sure you are, your business also solves problems, doesn't it? Just like medicine, it makes things better for people. But the downside is that mm, sometimes medicine doesn't taste good and people might reject the medicine on the basis of that. This happens when you get to the point in your client pitch where you mention the price. That's when people start to back away and turn up their nose because they just don't like the taste of it so much anymore. So how can stories help change that? Well, if your business is like the medicine, well, your story is like the sugar because your story wraps that bitter tasting medicine in a sweet, warm feeling of acceptance that comes from the fact that stories make you likable and build trust. And that helps break down the objections that you face when people come to hear the actual price point that you're offering. So if you wrap that medicine in a story, it's like you're making it sweet and pal palatable to them because stories create an emotional connection. And don't forget, when people make purchasing decisions, it is based on emotion more than anything else. So if you use a story, you're going to build that relatability and make people feel like they actually in the solution that you're offering them. So how, how do we find these stories that have that magic ability to turn a no into a yes? Well, if you book a story lab with me, I can help you find those powerful stories in just 90 minutes. You don't think that's very long, but I trust, trust me, I guarantee you, you will have a breakthrough in 90 minutes to start unlocking those stories. And then something fantastic happens because once you have that raw material, you can use that to build into your client conversations, into your social media, and even build, develop into a full on marketing strategy. And how do you book? Well, get in touch with me by email on annie at getstory.com or give me a call on 0027 76 358 2634. So that's it. That is exactly how using a story can turn a no into a yes in client conversations. Give me a call on the number that I've just given you, book a story lab, and let's get started. Don't you want to get storied?